Hey guys, how you doing? My name is JJ. What I'm about to show you is this device right here. This is my second one I own. It's a Novo X, 800 mil, as you can see. This is my old one. All right, I took it all apart. I'm gonna try to fix it here. Now, there's things that I need to show you. All right, you gotta be careful because you see here, as you can see, there's two screw holes. All right, those screw holes. <clears throat> this goes like this inside here. Just like that behind there. Where's my car? You got to take both plates off. Be careful for the front. You got to lift up the battery. You take the battery up. I'll show you. It's hard with the phone. Hold on one second. I'll try to put this here for a second. Without covering it. show you guys you see the battery batteries hold on lift the battery up battery is stuck okay the battery is a little glued that's okay there we go i got it sorry about that guys so you lift the battery up those are those are screw holes right there. Those little small things. You undo that first, okay? Sorry about my hands; they're dry as hell. But who gives a shit about that? Now, your next step is when you plug all this. You got to get those little screws in there. You see how dirty that shit is? I'm gonna clean it up and see if I can get this thing working again. I took this whole thing apart. I decided to come home one day and just hey. I had this device for like two years. I had this one for like, I don't know, six, seven months now. I like these. I don't like the bigger ones because, you know, you got to leave them in your damn car. They're too big to fit in your pocket. So when I'm at work, whatever, I got this little guy. If I need to take a puff, I take a puff. But right here is what you need. That's what I use. I want to see if I can get this running. These are the two tools. Because I don't have the regular type of screwdrivers it's a star head if you look real close inside there they're star heads okay so my best bet i use these two to get them loose i use this guy it's a little flathead screwdriver to get them more out then you pull this out you pull this guy out right here there's something i want to show you see how dirty that is in there it's really dirty, right? I'm going to make another video of this. Now, if, once you get your device apart, if you got a spare one, I am going to do this for shits and giggles and see. But you see this big bubble right there? This guy right here? There's a hole in there. I don't know if I can show you with the phone or not, but it, that hole is clogged. It's hard to see. There it is. You can see a very little bit. You can see like a tar substance in there. It goes right through. It is clogged. Okay. Now, I am going to let you guys go. I am going to... Oh, one more thing you need to be careful of. This guy right here. This is your breather. Which is, as you see... Sorry, see how tinty dark that is? Well, I'm going to clean that up. I'm going to use... Uh, Q-tips here I got. I'm going to clean the device. I am going to soak this in alcohol. You got these magnet things in here. They won't hurt. I'll soak that up real good. Get all that green shit off and all that. And this piece, this piece fits in that hole right there. Oops, I think I just fucked it up. It's okay. I, I, gotta, I can really weld that better here. And right there. See, no, I think God, I got soldering tools after the solder that back on. No biggie. I get it done. Simple and easy. But that's the issue with these things. So, well, I'll let you guys go. But that's the main purpose of it. You, you know, I worked on my son's, got his working. I just finally want to get this done here. But. I made more of a problem for myself than anything. 
Now I gotta get that soldered back on. Yay. It's gonna be fun. All right, guys. I'll post this in a little while, and I'll do a second video after it's all done. I'm sorry I look like shit. I work third shift. It sucks, but anyway. If you're having any issues with your Smoke X, Noble X device, you know, this one here is starting to, you know, you know um, hiss a little bit more. It's because of, everything's clogged in there. And this little hole here. So, I read the manual on this when I got it. It says you got to clean this thing every day with a Q-tip. Clean it. That's important. That's what I've been doing. It seems to be doing all right. It's stopping when you take a puff now because I cleaned it. But don't let it run until they get up to two or three. That's, that's too much for it. But other than that, it stopped. Before it'll still go by itself. You don't want that. But anyway. That's the whole main mojo. These three little guys here you need. Get all this apart step by step. So just remember when you take yours apart, the face pulls off. Sometimes you need this little guy right here. This little knife. You know, it works really good. And you just get the side. All these sides come off. You just poke at it and come off. Poke at it and come off. I cleaned this one already. Not a big deal, you know. Yeah, I got two of them. This is a noble two, though. This is a lot better because you can control your device right here. All right. I'm going to get to work and see what I can do. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys learn. Just you clean everything really well and stuff. I got to find me uh, my soldering gun. I don't know where the hell it is, but if I can't get this one running, that's all right. It's no big deal. It's just a project in a way. Talk to you guys later. Adios, peace.